Hello, welcome to Coco Candle Channel. I hope you're all having a nice day. Um, this video is a bit different from what I normally would um, upload. As you can see, um, I'm doing an unboxing of my very, very first uh, Louis Vuitton uh, Zippy coin purse. Um, during this quarantine, I've been watching a lot of videos. I've been reading a lot of articles and <clears throat> I've, I'm seeing a lot of um, features in Facebook about Louis Vuitton. So suddenly I had this urge to really get to know more about this um, particular uh, luxury product. I know it's a bit expensive and um, of course during these times uh, we, we should not be investing on luxury goods. But I said, um, why not? Um, it's it's okay uh, to buy my very first um, original um, bought from the store uh, item. So here you can see the Louis Vuitton um, Zippy coin purse. It took a while for me to know all the different models. But I've been um, watching a lot of videos and I think they call this as SLG. So SLG is for small leather goods. So today I did decide to go to uh, a Louis Vuitton store very close to our place. And um, I asked the sales assistant um, to show me the, the wallets, the small wallets. And um, she did bring out, I think, three. The first one was the Zoe wallet. Sorry for not mentioning the real model, but I'm not yet used to this. So the Zoe is the one with the pink flap. So when you open it, um, you can put cards, um, coins, but there was no partition for bills. And I found I find it a bit small for my um, liking. And then there was another Zoe, but it was more of a card holder type and i wasn't really um into it so i just went to the classic monogram um zippy coin purse so here you can see it's not the usual monogram but i think this is the how do you call it extra large monogram of louis vuitton so here you can see the lv and at the back you can see just the the flower or <laughs> they call it fleur de lis so i'll i'll learn along the way the reason why I like it because it's very compact. Um, I feel that all the cards that I put inside and the cash will be safe rather than having uh, an opening at the top. So if you put it inside your bag, I feel that it's going to fall. But um, I decided to get this. So this is actually my very, very first um, luxury product that I bought. Um, I don't plan to start a collection, but maybe I'll... I'll buy a few pieces. Actually, there's another story after this one. So let's just take a look at this. Um, I don't have the dimension, but I think you can visit the site and see the actual dimension. Of course, it came with this packaging and um, it came with this box. So if you open the box, um, it's just, um, you know, the normal one. You just slide it open and you can see here the dust bag, the dust bag. That's bug. Sorry, um, it's uh, Louis Vuitton. So just close it, and then just put it inside. Okay, just for this video, put it there. So um, it came with the, of course, with the official receipt. Um, this one. Um, okay, I have all my details here, so I won't be able to open it. But at least um, they issued uh, an official receipt and uh, a certification that it is original because i know that for this type of um, luxury goods if you decide to sell it then definitely uh, you can sell it at the current market price but of course this is for my personal consumption and i don't plan to sell it so let's open it so i did put my stuff already so it's just a straightforward uh, zipper when you open it, um, okay, you will see some some money here. So I just decided to put um, a few cards here. So I have two on this side and two on this side as well. And easily you can fit in um, your bills, but you have to fold it. 
but for me it's okay so there's still more space here at, at on the side and actually i think you can put your business card in the middle and also there's still more space there um, in the videos that I've watched, um, they normally put a lot of coins here, but I think it will deform the, the wallet, so I decided not to do that anymore. So, I'm so happy of my purchase. Uh, I'm sure I'll use this for a very, very long time. And this, the design is a uh, limited edition, and I believe this is made in France. And um, I think... I really do love it. So I bought it today, August 31, um, 2020. And this is not the only thing that I bought from the store. Um, actually, I did buy another one, but it's uh, a pre-loved um, pochette accessoires. Um, I saw it in Facebook and I fell in love with it. Um, I'll just show you first the picture right now. So this is the the pochette um, accessoires. I hope I pronounce it right. And this is, as you can see, the the wallet that I bought today from the store. And uh, when I was engaging with the with the buyer, um, she said that it was uh, original. It's authentic. Um, she classified it as A B, meaning um, it's been used, but um, there's really no damage at all and that it was really really in still in good condition so i did watch a lot of videos wherein um, i was uh, matching the fake versus the real one and i hope i made the right choice and it really looks like it's the real one and the good catch here is that um, she sold it together with the strap although this one um, had the original strap the the, sm the short one but um, she decided to give me a longer strap, which is also Louis Vuitton. And um, when I tried it with the bag, it looks perfect. So this is just my daily bag that I use because I don't really want to, big up, to, bring out, to bring with me a big bag. So I think having a, a sling bag and a, a very compact wallet will really uh, be very helpful or be very nice. For me to go around so let me show you the actual um let me show you the actual product okay so i hope nobody calls me okay let me show you the actual product bear with me so this is how it looks like so this is the mini pochette accessoires um when i checked the it's really really in good condition it's made in france and you can see here that the zipper is still working fine there's no problem there and if you look at the back portion um it's really um still in a very very good condition no scratch nothing and um when i check the inside of the bag you can see that it's really really still in a very very good condition and um, there's no damage inside and there's the okay sorry there's also the label here you can see here that it's uh, VI and when I checked it was um, manufactured 09 so that's I think September 2000 so this bag is already vintage and it's already almost yeah 20 years old but still in a very very good condition the good thing uh with this one is that it it was uh, came with a strap so this is how the strap looks like so according to the seller they she doesn't sell any fake goods so i trusted her so that's the reason i bought um this as well so in terms of, um, I bought this first early in the morning today and I decided to go to the shop, excuse me, to the shop um, later in the afternoon. And when I try them together, it's really a perfect match. It's really a perfect match. I love it so much. So let me just show you how I, uh, what I put inside my pochette accessoires. So here you can see that the space inside is very big you can put a lot of things um so normally i just put my 
my zippy coin purse then of course I'll put my airpods inside and I can also put my driver's license so I'm looking for a, a card holder that can match this as well but for now this will do and of course the phone that I'm using to film this video uh, will definitely fit perfectly inside so there you have it uh, my very first um, purchase of Louis Vuitton um, maybe maybe you'll never know I'll buy more in the future but for now I'll really enjoy my wallet and my uh, pochette so with that said thank you for watching Coco Candle channel I hope you are all safe um, take care and see you in my next video bye